All right, guys, I'm super excited for this demo. I have the Hotone Ampero 2 stage. Really excited about this multi effects unit. Uh, it's got so many different sounds uh, amp and cab sims. You got a drum machine, uh, looper. This thing is the real deal. So I'm actually on tour here in Brazil. I just did Rock and Rio. Uh, two nights ago, I just did some follow, so we're here in this hotel room, it's pretty sweet, and uh, I'm just so excited that I've just been wanting to just share this with you, so I'm doing this demo here in Brazil before I even get back home. But um, really excited about this thing, I've been doing a lot of really cool presets on this. All right, so let's get right into this thing. Check it out, you got all of these sound boxes, um, five different options, you have uh, a bank up and down, uh, you got some knobs for some other parameters that you can use, uh, hold for bypass or this switches from stomp to patch mode we'll get into that later you got your volume menu vol uh, value little lock button which is really cool um, it's really well made high quality casing high quality product i'm super satisfied with everything that hotel has done with this thing um, on the back it is decked out with expression and control you got two of them you have your input mono or you can also input stereo so here is a uh, XLR input, and it's also, it could be instrument cable. Um, you have your stereo effects loop, send and return, your output left and right. And the cool thing about this, it does uh, switch to mono right when you only go left. So if you have stereo effects, it'll sum it for you, which is great, because sometimes I'll have to use other products to do that for me. Um, you also have a balanced output via XLR, the same thing, left and right, sum to mono left and then you have a ground lift this has literally helped me the other day i was playing a gig and uh there was some buzzing you know wires crossing or whatever it happens all the time and i was like oh man i wish we had a ground lift on it and i was like oh dude no problem boom ground lift perfect you have your aux in headphone out out through midi in USB C power and of course the uh, power output so this thing is decked out guys and um, I'm actually for this demo I'm going to be using also uh, the Hotone Tuner Press it's a volume uh, tuner and expression all in one so I have some wah settings that I'll show you guys but um, I'm really excited about these this product I've done uh, some really cool presets that I've been so stoked about and they are pretty much tailored uh, with an amp and cab simulator um, all stock so you don't have to go out and buy anything else but while I'm here touring in Brazil I've been using amps like Fender Deluxe Reverb uh, style. So I go left and right out and um, I've actually been just turning off the amp and cab simulator and using the same presets I already use and it has been like insane. I'll show you guys a clip of this. So yeah, as you can tell, it sounds absolutely killer. The Ampero 2 stage is a beast. Uh, let's go ahead and plug it in. I'll show you guys these presets. I'm super excited about them, and I think you'll love them. Let's check it out. All right, so here we go. We have the Ampero 2 stage loaded up with my tuner press. Uh, I got it connected via curling patch cable and as well as a TRS expression going into the expression in. So that's gonna, I'll use that with the wah. I'll show you guys in a sec. But here you go, here are my preset settings. Um, you know, you can use this in many ways. Preset mode, uh, you have scenes, you can have just like, just kind of like a normal pedal board where you're just turning on and turning off effects. So um, that's what I use it on, I use this on Stomp, and um, I use this where I'm just kind of turning these individual effects on and off. And the cool thing with these presets is you can, you know, put them in yours and then anytime you want to change it, you can go ahead and rearrange things, you can uh, change up the tone, but also you can change the function of these FS switches. So, um, for an example here, this one's turning on my first drive and then it's my second drive. And I know that's like opposite right now, but basically I have my first stage drive and my second stage drive goes into it. So I'll show you guys all that in a sec. But um, you rearrange this, customize it to, you know, what works best for you. So I'll go ahead and show you all the presets I have. So got Nobes, vers Versatile, 
you got Nob's Rock, Speaks for Itself, Nob's Worship. As I, you know, I'm a church musician. I play um, not only gospel, but also CCM stuff. So there's a lot of, it's basically like a, a versatile ambient pack, right? So it's not too ambient, but yeah, and you'll be able to hear it. And then uh, Nob's Ambient is super ambient. Like you have to play nice and slow. Uh, you can't do fast playing at all. And if you mess up, you know, it'll trail for a long for a long time. But yeah, it's a really cool effect. I'll show you guys that later. And then Nob's Wah, which I'm using on this tour with Glory Gainer. She um, sings I Will Survive. So I'll kind of show you uh, a little bit of how I use that. Um, so let's go ahead and go back to Nob's Versatile. So right off the bat, I got some compressors, drives. So this is pretty much uh, Hotone's version of these drives. So um, some of these, you know, you'll be familiar with. But the amp I'm using throughout is the Black Vibra. It sounds really great. And then I have these um, 412s uh, cab simulator. So, um, yeah, so I got two drives. Over here I have an envelope filter. Uh, I have a chorus, which I love so much. A mini vibe, rotary, tremolo, some delay, analog delay, and uh, a nice subtle cloud reverb, which is kind of like an ambient reverb, but... I have it settled. So I'll go ahead and show you how I use this thing. Let's hear how it sounds. Oh, and I'm also using my Veritas Double Cut Portlander. It's kind of like a Strat style, humbucker, single, single. Um, so yeah, you'll be hearing that for the whole demo. So yeah, it's a really nice clean sound. Really like that I have some delay and I can always you know tap and right away I can switch to my chorus sound you'll hear in a lot of these presets I have that chorus because I love the sound so much, but I can always change this to sound or to, you know, play a different um, different modulation effect that I have on hand, right? So, yeah, real quick, so, chorus. And then I can change it to, you know, another one, but here's this really cool envelope filter. Super cool sound. So yeah, I mean, like you can already tell how versatile um, all these sounds are. You already heard the chorus. Here's a mini vibe. This is just a gorgeous sound. I absolutely love that sound um you go ahead and um go to my little kind of tremolo sound i'll do a fast setting so you guys kind of hear it Yeah, and then I'll go to uh, my drive. So here you go, here's my first stage. So I'll use that for uh, some rock or I'll do um, some country stuff. Uh, you could do a lot with this, but. Add the second stage.
really cool sounds. Um, of course, I can add chorus to that too. So with this sound, I can pretty much play everything, any genre, straight up, whatever you need. This preset has it. Um, let's go ahead and go to the rock one. This is a little bit more simple. This is when I just want that kind of rock sound, right? This shuts off that second stage so it could be a little bit lighter. But pretty much I'm using this preset with this one. And of course I got the chorus. a boost specifically for this so that when I need to do solo there's without there's with That sounds sick. So you got your tremolo and a chorus option. And once again, you can always change this up. You know, if you want a different sound or a different modulation effect, or even, you know, you want to experiment with some different delays or even overdrives, you can always use this as a template. I'll go ahead and go to the Nobes Worship. So once again, church musician, a lot of gospel stuff, but then also CCM, which has a kind of like an ambient kind of thing to it. And this is just a versatile ambient sound. So I'll show you what I mean. So yeah, it's got this beautiful vintage rack delay with modulation. I got the cloud as well. Such a pretty sound. And then I'll have my um, chorus, of course, you know me. <laughs> Go into second, first stage drive. Second stage drive. There you go, let's go to that super ambient one. Now, I just absolutely love this one. Super fun for me, I really uh, went all out here. I have a 
stereo expander, what they call it. You know, it just widens the stereo image. Um, I do have like a first stage drive just for a little bit. And then you got your amp, cab, um, mini vibe, liquid C, chorus, dual delay. I have two delays here. So the second delay is actually kind of like a shimmer sound. And of course I have the cloud. And the stereo uh, expander is always on. I'm gonna also swell with the volume pedal so you guys get a really cool ambient experience. So I'm sure you can notice that kind of high frequency octave shimmer thing going on. So that's the bloodless delay there. And um, I have it nice and light because I want it to kind of creep in when I play, not too loud in your face. But um, so that kind of blooms as you stop playing essentially. <laughs> Super cool. And then I can go ahead and add my drive. Go ahead and add some chorus. And the mini vibe. It just adds some awesome texture. Absolutely love that sound. I can play that literally forever. All right, here we go to our last preset. This is the Nobs Wah. So I use this pretty much for this uh, Gloria Gaynor gig that I have. So she sings I Will Survive. So this is all disco funk, nice and clean. <laughs> But I got some cool sounds too, so I'm gonna go ahead and shift to expression. So you just tap down on the volume, and I'm gonna turn on this wah and essentially kind of like a wah and envelope filter thing. <laughs> sound uh, of course you know me I got that chorus <laughs> kind of like it when it's just clean but I love using this wall actually with distortion that is sick <laughs> So yeah, super cool, amazing presets. You guys can check out these presets at The Sound Shop. I'll send a link or put a link in the bio. Uh, thanks for listening. I absolutely love this unit. I'm using it all the time now. And I love that I can use this with the amp and cap sims or just plug it into amps and just turn essentially these off. That's it. So let me know what you guys think and I hope you enjoy it. Thanks. <laughs>